Hey guys, so I've always wanted to film a mukbang and um, we're gonna do that right now because I'm alone at home, again, a prime opportunity for me to film, but um, I have this amazing poke bowl <laughs> that my mom got me while I was in school. So um, I wanna eat that, but I also wanna film a video. So we're doing a mukbang. Uh, I need a fork. I'm so happy today. I have like very minimal homework. I mean, I have a research paper due tomorrow, but like I already finished that and really all I have to do is edit it a little bit and I'm good. And then, yeah, I really don't have much else to do. <coughs> wow, okay, I don't know what happened there, but I need to get water because that was rough. This is Oreo. She's, she's, she's sniffing this. You can't have me, poke people. You have to be dog food. This guy's heavy. This is Max. He's a big boy. Shit. Also, I forgot to say, if you're new here and you have never seen my face before, then you should subscribe if you're into that. I promise I post more videos than me just eating food, but um, this is, this is all you're getting today. So I was watching some of my old videos the other day and I just got super nostalgic. And, but like the thing is, it wasn't even from that long ago. I think the first video where I actually talked to a camera, I filmed about a year ago, but it's like, wow, such a different time. Like, I remember the day I filmed my get to know me tag was that was the first video that I ever filmed on this for this channel. When I filmed that tag, that was the day that I had just cut my hair. And like my hair was literally here. And now look at how long it's grown. And that's wild. I really need to get a chop though. What I'm thinking about for my hair is like either I chop it back to where it was or I get like a little a little cut, maybe not like all the way up here, but maybe more like that. And then I dye it, like balayage. Um, and I've been wanting to do like balayage or ombre ever since that style became a trend, but I just never had the guts to do it because my hair is like black, black. So if I wanted to get it to a lighter color, I'd probably have to bleach it and my hair is pretty healthy, so like I don't really want to ruin that, you know what I mean? But anyways, that was really off topic, but what I was saying before was I was watching my old videos, and even though they weren't filmed that long ago, I just feel like, I don't know, it was just so different. Wow, well, my mangoes are falling. But yeah, that was the whole point of that long, stupid story. How long do mukbangs go? Like, do you just keep filming until you're done eating, or like, how does this work? Also, because I was watching my old videos, my first week of school vlog, I remember saying that like, I'll update you guys later into my senior year to see if I wanna die yet, and um, update, I wanna die. Not like actually wanna die, I still got things to do, but it's like the thought of doing those things is just, oof. I don't know how people can film mukbangs and keep talking, because sometimes I just wanna like, enjoy my food but gotta keep you guys entertained you know what i mean by the way i am literally leaning my phone against a takeout container so sorry if the angle's weird i just want to put out there i film my videos so far in advance today's march 7th this video is probably going to be going up in late april because i just have so many other videos lined up before that that need to go up and honestly that's just a testament to how my work ethic is not this year Senior year, I've kind of been slacking and procrastinating a little bit, but like in my early years of high school, once my teacher gave me an assignment, I'd get it done right away. Cause I just, I wanted it over with. I didn't want to have to worry about it anymore. But like I said, this year I've kind of been procrastinating a little bit. So I'm hoping that when I get to college, I can fall back into that habit, but I'm going to have a lot more free time in college and classes are going to have more difficult materials. So I'm hoping I will be able to manage my time just as well as I did in high school. And also, Drexel goes by a quarter system. Instead of taking one set of classes one semester and then another set another semester, we do that three times in a year. So college for me is definitely gonna go by a lot faster and I'm gonna be taking a lot more classes in one year than an average college student in the semester schedule. But like, I'm kind of down with that. So my major is in Drexel's College of Media Arts and Design, Westfall. When I posted like my commitment post on Instagram, I was contacted by 
the person that runs Drexel West Falls Instagram account and they're like, hey, can we repost your picture? And I was like, hell yeah. So they did that. And then this guy reached out to me because he saw I was featured on there. He was like, hey, if you have any questions about the music industry program, like reach out to me. So I asked a couple questions. I was like, what's your first quarter like? He said the classes are so easy. They're like the most basic music courses. But um, he also said he had a lot of free time in his first quarter, which I'm so down for. Because then I'll have a decent amount of time to film YouTube videos. So that's lit. I really want to start doing more with my music. I have songs that I've been working on, um, and I really want to release an EP soon. I've been wanting to release an EP literally since like the beginning of my senior year. I also want to make music videos for my songs too, but like I have no idea how to direct that or I need someone to film it, and I want someone that's like actually good at videography. I don't want it to be just like my friend holding my phone. I need to figure that out, but hopefully when I get to college, I'll meet like a bunch more people that are really good at videography. And it'll be a lot easier to meet up with them when I'm in college because right now, like I don't drive, I don't have a car. So I can't just like call my friend and be like, hey, can we meet up and like film a video? I can't just do that because I, not only do I not have a mode of transportation, I also don't really have the time and I know my friends don't have the time I feel like in college will be so much easier because we're literally all living in the same place and we're gonna be in Philly so there's like so many different spots that I can just like film at and it's gonna be so cool I have friends at my school I think most of my subscribers actually are my friends in school and they watch my videos they're gonna see this mukbang and they're gonna be like Ashley what the fuck I love to eat okay so I think it only makes sense that one of my videos is gonna be a mukbang. What kind of topics can I rant about? Prom. Oh, oh shit. <laughs> okay, so here's the deal. I ideally want to go to prom with a date, just cause like that's the whole experience of it, but also because like for like three years of my high school experience, I thought I was going to have a date for prom. Um, that ended up falling apart. So now it's like, shit. <laughs> I'm gonna be going alone and for a while that was like not okay with me i really didn't want to go alone to prom but then at some point i was like yo what's the point of having a date because when you have an image in your head about how prom is gonna go and then all of a sudden like that image shatters it's like nothing else is gonna live up to that expectation you know what i mean so i was like you know what problem with this person isn't gonna work out obviously why should I settle for someone else just because I want to still kind of fulfill that imagination I had in my head? Like, why do that when I can just go on my own, be a queen, I can just go with my friends to prom and we'll have a blast and I don't need a date. I already have my prom dress, which I'm not going to show until my get ready with me for prom vlog because you bet your ass I'm going to be doing that video. If I don't do that video, then like, I'm going to be breaking the expectations I have for myself because I know I'm going to do that video for prom. I know I'm going to vlog graduation or maybe just like a get ready with me for graduation. But like I have so many plans for videos, especially like towards the end of senior year and the beginning of my freshman year of college. When I get to college, you bet your ass I'll be filming a lot of Drexel shit because I, when I was applying to Drexel, I'm like that was my top school. So like I really wanted to know everything about it. When I went on YouTube, there were only like three videos about Drexel and like student life there. I got you guys. I'm going to cover everything future applicants of Drexel want to know. I haven't gotten there yet, but I will. Okay. I have finished. So. Thank you guys so much for watching this mukbang. I'm sorry if it wasn't as entertaining as you expected it to be, but that's just because I'm not an entertaining person, so I don't really know why I do this. So if you made it to this point in the video, you are a very good human, and be sure to hit the subscribe button down below if you haven't already. Um, and yeah, I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!